Hi there, this is Unmesh from Piximperfect and today I'm going to share with you a more natural way to fix color fringing around the edge while cutting out objects. As you can see, have a look at this subject. Here we have a white background and on top of that we have the subject cut out. This was the original image. I have removed the green background and this is the result. As you can see, the masking is perfect. Have a look at the mask. The mask is so good with all the hair detailed. However, if you have a look at the result, it still carries the green. Not the fault of the mask. The mask is good. It's just that the hair is so thin that it takes up the color of the background. Have a look at the background. Background is so saturated, the hair is bound to take up its color. There's an easy way to fix that. Let me show that to you. All you have to do is to create a hue saturation adjustment layer. Click on the adjustment layer icon right there and then choose hue saturation. Now we need to target the green and change it. Just change the hue and saturation. That's it. So first of all, from the drop down, we're going to choose greens. Next step, take the hue all the way to the right and the saturation all the way to the right to see which colors are being affected. Now here is the range slider. Which range of colors? are we targeting so we can expand it we can make it narrower so in this case just make sure all of the greens are selected we don't need to go into the yellows which is the hair color we don't need to go there and you can use these two sliders to soften the transition the more the gap between these two the softer the transition would be so i'm going to keep it right there i think most of the green is now selected expand it on the other side so it's selecting all of the greens at the moment. Let's bring the saturation and the hue back to normal positions. And from here, let's zoom out and adjust it so that all of the greens are gone. So first, let's adjust the hue so that it matches with that of the original color of the hair. Have a look. At this point, it's perfect. You can also control the saturation if you want to. Look, the color, the green just went away. You don't have to do anything at all. You can try decreasing the saturation or increasing the saturation according to your taste or change the lightness as well but at this point i think it's fixed so there you go a very easy way to remove color fringing from hair however this might be a problem if inside the subject or inside the selection there is something in green color also there is one more problem you cannot change the background to something closer to green or blue otherwise the hue saturation adjustment layer will affect that as well have a look look at the color that we have selected and it shows up green in the background so here is what you have to do first of all hit cancel and make sure that the hue saturation adjustment layer is limited just to the subject layer hold the alt key or the option key click on the line between these two now it's only limited to the subject layer now you can go ahead and choose any background that you like and this would work with that so red blue yellow green anything works fine now do keep in mind that the hue saturation adjustment layer will also change anything that is green inside of the mask or in the selection so if she was wearing a green colored jewelry it would change too so in that case you would have to select the mask then press ctrl or command i and then take the brush make sure that the foreground color is white make the brush a little larger and only paint over the areas where the green fringe was showing up you don't have to be accurate and there you have it so that's a super easy way to deal with color fringing in photoshop if this technique doesn't work there are lots of techniques in my channel that you can refer and watch please do check the link in the description i hope this video helped i will see you guys in my next one till then stay tuned and make sure that you keep creating